see the potential. <laughs> Ceiling got stars when the star got no ceiling. Stick it out, poke it out, stick it out. Well, hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Kyra Sean. Today's video is brought to you by me. I purchased it with my own coin. It is also Sip and Slay, and your girl got her tea and her wine today. Cause listen, your girl had a week. <laughs> Mm, I need all of it. But anyway, before I get into the install of the specs and what I think about this unit straight out the pack, make sure if you're new to the channel, you go ahead and subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up. Also give this video a thumbs up if you want to see more videos like this in the future. Let's we go. We're trying the new Sensational Curls Kings & Co. 13 by 6 textured lace wig in the style Kinky Bob 9 inch. I got it in the color 1B and I have been waiting for this wig for months, okay? Sensational dropped it on their Instagram um, like two months ago and they kept saying coming soon and I'm like girl when because <laughs> This right here is what I want, and I got it. This is how she's looking on the stock card. She looks gorgeous. I'm hoping that it gives me the look that I want it to give me. It does come in some special colors. I also got the, which one is this? HL2 280-44. These are the three grades right here. I got the darkest one. I will show you guys how that looks on me later on, but for now, we are just installing the 1B. It says you can wear it glueless. We'll see how it looks once I put it on my head. This is how the card is looking on the inside. They give you all the information. It comes with the kinky edges, so hopefully it's not too crazy in the front. Hey, I'm not in a rush today, but I don't feel like sitting in front of this camera for an hour either. So I'm still gonna put this on as fast as possible. So this is what the wig is looking like out the pack. It feels, oh man, <laughs> like blown out Kanekalon. It's not the texture I thought it was gonna be. On her card, she gives very natural. Like that looks like her hair. So basically when this wig gets stiff, Edna. <laughs> maybe I'll add some heat to it and maybe that'll sleek it out a little bit. This is the left side part. No, it's a 13 by six. Oof, I can change it. <laughs> so I'm gonna move my part over, but it does come already styled in the left side part. This is what the hairline is looking like, but I feel like this is gonna blend out really nicely. The hair itself feels very light. That's always a plus, especially because Mother Nature's going through the change. That's the only way to explain it. Okay, she hot one second, cold the next. I don't know. But this is what that parting space is looking like. That's a good amount of parting space, 13 by six. You get the combs on the side, the elastic band already attached in the wig, and then the adjustable strap and the comb in the back. I'm gonna use my Black Radiant Soft Focus Powder in the color Creamy Bronze to tint my lace. If you have lace spray, go ahead and use that. It's a little bit easier, but it is messy in my opinion. Even though it is glueless, I may spray it down just because I want this to, to sit. Let's see how the cap will fit with the elastic band. Hopefully it won't be too tight. Feels pretty decent. With the elastic band on the back, it feels pretty good. I see the potential. <laughs> I'm gonna pull some of these peasies out in the front because right now it's pretty much straight across. I take my blow dryer and my bristle brush and I'm gonna blow dry the front on high heat to straighten this out. I think that's looking pretty good. Let me just pull this out right here. Kind of break that up a little bit. This may actually work out better than I thought. Let's cut my lace off. I mean, obviously I could leave it how it is without spraying it down, but I think I want to spray it down. Let me just mess with the hairline before I spray it down just to make sure it's going to be how I want it. I don't want a sharp widow's peak, so I'm just going to cut some of this off. I'm going to use my ultimate hold melt spray. Not on my hair, on my forehead, because I got a lot of poor hair real estate, so I can do that. Then we're gonna bring it down, blow dry it on cool. I'm gonna use a little bit right here on the side. I want the hair to look very like wispy, but I also want it to stay in place. Comb this out. Not as bumped on the ends. Ooh, Edna. <laughs> All right, let me flatten it down on the top. Use warm and high heat. A little more spray because she started lifting. Get my front situated. Use my Juvia's Place foundation stick in the color Katsina just to blend my lace. Do a little powder in my parting space. Now it does say this wig is heat safe up to 350 or 400, but mine is on 285. So I wanna see if she sleeks out the hair a little bit. Kinda adds a little bump. Okay, a little extra sleekness. Okay, she bumping. Bumpity bump, bump, bumpity bump, bump. The heat definitely made the hair look a little bit more natural. I think we are 
finished. It's given, let me speak to your manager. <laughs> <laughs> immediately. She came together. I have no other complaints about this wig outside of the texture. I wish it was not as synthetic. I know that sounds weird because this is a synthetic wig. It's given like starter pack kinky straight. And I thought we moved past that for Sensational. I feel like Sensational has a better texture than this. I could be wrong, but this feels like um, Alpha Woman. That's kind of the vibe that I'm getting with this texture. But as an overall wig, I think she is beautiful. The hairline looks good. They are definitely working on that uh, kinky edge look. So when you straighten them out, they give more of a natural look. This could be an everyday look for me. Again, she will get stiff based on this texture. That's pretty much all I gotta say for this one. So, you know, this is how it looks in the gray color. You know, you tell me down below which one you like more. Hold up, let me put my rings back on. But that's pretty much all I got for you guys today. I will put the direct link for my unit down below. So if you guys wanna check it out, you can. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. Also smash the notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up. I love you guys so much and I will see you next time. Bye.